Hi everyone, uh, Travel Addict a Guy here, and we're on Alameda to Hercules, and we just settled a argument we had about Tesla and Thomas Edison. Edison with the AC and DC, and Miko was right, he got me, I was confused mm. with it. I thought that Tesla was for the DC, and Edison was for the AC, but it's the opposite way. Oh, so that's how it was. Yeah, you're right, now Miko. Now you got confused again. <laughs> All right. Well, whatever, you're right, Miko. So, well, now we're using AC, but it was actually Tesla's idea. Yeah. Okay, now that we got that out of the way, guys, we're at Casa Paco, and we're gonna have some tapas here. Isn't that the plan? Hmm, we could do that. And someone asked for it. I know someone asked for it in the comment section. So we're gonna eat here. We're gonna go to Casa Paco. Let's do it, guys. Here it is. Casa Paco. And they got tapas of the day, guys. Look at this. So we're gonna try this out. Comida and Abinos. So we're gonna get a table, guys. We'll let you know how this one is. Cannot wait to try it out. And there's actually the temperature behind me. Miko said it was 39.5. And what time is it, Miko? Yeah, it's uh... <laughs> Celsius. 8.40. 8.40 p.m. and it's 39.5 Celsius. Woo, it is hot. And I actually have to say, I was here around six months ago and I ate here with a friend of mine, Thomas. And someone else had asked about it, so we're gonna redo it. We're gonna try it out again, guys. Miko has not tried it, so why not? Let's do it. So let's set it off with the salud. Today I'm drinking water, guys. <laughs> gonna take a rest. And take a look where we are, guys. Take a look. The people are coming out now. They come out in the evening here in Sevilla. There's a dog in the restaurant, guys. Hey, hola. <laughs> ah. Okay, so it's somebody here's, I guess. Adventure dog today on the Adventure Channel. <laughs> and we got an adventure cat. We got a cat and a dog today. <laughs> okay, guys, so here it is inside. It's not too big. Hola. Tengo que de YouTube. Hola. ¿Cómo te llamas? Laura. Laura, ok, Encantada. muy bien. Ok. Un placer. Uh, mi nombre es Carrie. Encantada. Y soy de Estados Unidos. De Estados Unidos, bienvenida a Sevilla. Ok, perfecto. ¿Y tú de dónde eres? De aquí, de Sevilla. De aquí de Camas. De Camas. Ah, ok. Ok, muy bien, gracias. Ok, very friendly people here, guys. Uh, we're inside of this bar here. It is Costa Paco. And a shout out to my friend Thomas. So that's my show. We're here with Thomas. And look at this, they've got this old scooter on the wall. A good selection of wines, guys. You got your Cruz Campo. And there's the time, 9 o'clock, guys. <laughs> so, cannot wait to try these tapas, guys. Wow, gonna try out these great Spanish tapas. And the people so, so friendly, guys. That woman inside from Camas. Ah, okay, perfecto, okay. Buen provecho. Okay, gracias. De nada. Okay, so this is the Huevo, Wisconsin, guys. Wow. So the first one comes out, they serve them to you one at a time. Wow, we got the Huevo, Wisconsin, guys. Look at that, wow. I've never seen that top of you, uh, Catman? Oh, uh, it's kind of different. So this is supposed to be a dish, a Wisconsin dish, I guess. Huevo, Wisconsin, guys. So I know who would know about this, guys. My friend, Adventure Elliot, guys. I'm gonna call up Adventure Elliot right now and show him this dish. And let's see if this is the real deal, guys. Let's see if this is the real deal, guys. Calling right now, Adventure Elliot. What up? Hey, man, what's up? How you doing? Just back in the inferno of Madrid. It's so hot here. Oh yeah, you just got back, huh? We got this dish here, man. I want to show it to you. Oh, here's some more stuff coming. Wow. Okay. Uh, some more stuff coming, Elliot. Look at that. Wow. We got some more stuff. Okay, now this dish, this dish here is called Huevo, Wisconsin, man. Have you ever heard of something like that? Eggs from Wisconsin. We have a lot of eggs in my home state. Of course I've heard of it. Okay, but have you, have you seen this dish before? This one, I'm going to show it to you right there. Not in Spain. Okay, Tell man. All right, man. So we got something new today, guys. Wave of Wisconsin with Adventure Elliot, man. Okay. <laughs> All right, bro. And you just got back from Wisconsin, I guess, right? <laughs> yeah, exactly. You know, I got back from Portugal. I was in Portugal. <laughs> okay, cool, man. All right. One thing I know 
about Wisconsin is we got some big huevos there. <laughs> big huevos, yeah, I got that joke, man, yeah. <laughs> okay, bro. All right, well, we're gonna try this huevo Wisconsin. Uh, I just thought I wanted to call you up, man. I was gonna do a shout out, but I figured call you up would be the best, bro. All right, I got video from Northern Spain and Portugal coming. Thanks awesome. for the shout out and enjoy those big eggs. Awesome, man. Okay, we'll, we'll let you know. Watch the video to see how they are, bro. I'm following you every step of the way. Enjoy your time and step again thereafter. Cool, man. Have a great night, man. All right. Adios. Man and travel guy. Yeah. Hey. <laughs> okay. See you, man. Adios. <laughs> that was very cool, man. Look at that. <laughs> okay, guys, we got it right there from the expert, Adventure Elliot. He gave us his take on this Weibo, Wisconsin. This Wisconsin egg. Okay, guys. Why don't you try that out, Cat Man? Look at it. It looks very different. Give it a try, Cat Man. Oh, it's got potato chips in it. Look at that, guys. Wow. It's got potato chips. How does that taste? Like garlic and olive oil, I think. Garlic and olive oil. Okay, wow. And there's actually an egg in there? Here, take uh, take a fork, cat man. Dig into there. Oh, you got one already. There's a knife. Maybe you want to cut into it. Okay, dig into there. Take a piece of that and tell us what it's like. Check that out. Wow. Mm -hmm. Wow, nice. Different dish, guys. And we've also got tartare de salmon, guys. Look at that. Wow, that is nice. So let me go ahead and try this. I'm going to try it now, guys, and see what it tastes like. Wow, you almost have to eat it with your hands. I think Catman's right. Okay, let me get this. It's got potato chips. I guess it's finger food, guys. Potato chips. We got some of that there. So let me go ahead this way. Wow, what a mix. I think you do, you have some olive oil, you taste the garlic, wow, some strong garlic. That pepper is nice. Very, very interesting, guys, almost like a finger food, but a different take, and you've got that ham in there as well, wow. Such an interesting dish, guys, wow. This is street food in Sevilla. Let me get some of that egg with it. Crunchy, guys, with those, um, Potato chips. So I've got some of the egg now. Let me try the egg. I gotta try the egg because it's called Weibo. It sounds strange, guys, but somehow it actually goes together. It goes together quite well, don't you think, Catman? Yeah, mm -hmm. Yeah, it's a nice meat. That's a nice dish, guys. It's really nice. Very different. Especially for Spanish cuisine. Very different, but quite good. There's cloves of garlic in this thing, guys. Look at that, look at that. That's a clove of garlic. Wow, they did not go... Easy on the garlic for sure. Very heavy on the garlic, but heavy on the flavor as well. And maybe you're a bit hungry, who knows? <laughs> <laughs> hungry you got, a, you got a friend there, uh, Miko? Yeah, I like the hairy friends. Yeah, that's they, a pretty dog, wow. Mm. Gorgeous dog, look at that, guys. Mm. Beautiful. He's a beauty. Hey, buddy. Okay, Miko's gonna try that salmon tartare. Probably with the fork. Take some with the fork. There you go. <laughs> Good salmon? Miko's the mm. salmon man. Yeah. Tasty? Okay. Tartar guys. Look at that. Wow. Just break into that. All of that together. Wow. I'm just going to take a bite of it like this without the cracker first. Mmm. Well, you got a lot of flavor in there. Some different things going on in there. Almost tastes like a fruit or something in there. Maybe it's the sauce. The tartare. Really refreshing. I'm not sure what that sauce is. It's a tartare, I guess, but very refreshing. It's not something I normally eat. It's a tartare. But it's quite nice, guys. It's quite nice. And that can usually be quite expensive in a lot of restaurants. So for $4.50, that's pretty good. Okay, guys. So it says soy mayonnaise in there. And there is some fruit in there. I was right about that, guys. There is some apple in there. So there's actually some apple. 
So it is a soy mayonnaise. That's what it is, guys. I thought I tasted a little bit of fruit, and I was actually right, guys. It was actually some fruit in there. I was kind of doubting myself, but there was a little bit of fruit in there. And there's the tartare, guys. I'm going to try it on a cracker now. Look at that. Lovely. That is lovely. And it's starting to get a little bit dark now. Mm -hmm. <laughs> wow. <laughs> What a flavor. Nice flavor with a cracker. I actually like it with a cracker. It's really, really nice. Okay, one more dish, guys. Beautiful dish there. That is moussaka. Look at that. Looking gorgeous. It's got eggplant, it's got cheese in there, and it has the eggplant. One of the mm. things you like, Catman. Yeah, it's, it's like lasagna a bit. Like the... Kind of like sauce. lasagna. Wow, mm. okay. But with meat in it. Huh? Kind of with meat in it. It's got meat in it too. Really? Yeah, it has meat in there. Yep. It's got some meat in there too. Maybe um, closer to the center, guys. Look at that. There's even some rucola in there. Wow, so nice. I'm gonna give it another bite. Mm -hmm. yeah. A nice combination. So let's move here with Thomas. I had this moussaka, guys. So I'm gonna try some now. Let me get some of that. Look at that, guys. Wow. Cut a piece of that, guys. Look at that. Look at that, guys. Look inside of there. Ooh, that is nice. You can see the meat in there. And you know it has to be tender. You know it has to be tender because Miko thought that it was a lasagna. So kind of similar. You got the cheese on the top. You got the meat there. And you've got some eggplant in there as well. So a nice flavor combination here. Hmm. <laughs> Yeah, that's nice. I can see where Miko's coming from. It does have that taste of that kind of like a white lasagna a little bit, but with the meat in there and that sauce, I think it takes it to another level. And that's what I like about it. So it comes time to select our dishes now, guys. Wow, it's a difficult choice. They're all so good today. Wow, all three tapas, I enjoyed all of them. Wow, which one should I go for? <laughs> I think I'm gonna go with the tartare. I actually like that because it's something different. I'm actually enjoying that. Wow, that um, Wisconsin omelet is very, very good as well. And so is the moussaka. So I think I'm gonna go tartare, the omelet, the Wisconsin omelet, and then the moussaka. That's the way I'm gonna rate them. But they're all really good, guys. They're all eight or above, in my opinion. I think they're actually close to nine, all of them, around that. So that's the way I'm gonna score it. What did you enjoy the most? Uh -huh. Yeah, I think uh, this Wisconsin egg, it's, uh, yeah, it's uh, something I haven't tried, so I would like it more. Okay. And uh, lasagna with different name is the second, <laughs> and this uh, small piece of uh, fish is uh, the last. Okay. Okay. Okay, well, that's how he rated it. Okay, thank you. Mm -hmm. Nico, not a fan of the tartare, surprisingly, because he's from, he said he likes fish a lot, so... Interesting. Just has a different flavor than the Finland, you said, right? Well, because this one is probably brought from Norway or something, so it's always kind of sketchy, especially with the tartars. I've been eating um, sushi, raw fish forever, and I haven't ever had an issue, really. So, anyway, that is the ratings, guys, in Casa Paco. Wow, the people are really coming out now, guys. They're really coming out. You can see a lot of people walking around now. Look at this. They're coming out in the evening. This is definitely an evening town, guys. Sevilla. Here's the bill. It was $16.90 for all that, so pretty good. So that's the Casa Paco. We enjoyed this dinner here. Travel addict a guy and Miko. The cat man. There he is, baby. Oh, yeah. <laughs> it was good. Take care, everyone.